Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are gonna start our third installation series on this brand new Triton XT12 VR. We just picked this thing up from our friends down at MEG Trailer here in Ramsey, Minnesota. This is a standard 12 foot V-nose drive on, drive off trailer. We're gonna look at a few different product options that are gonna help you get where you need to go when you're loading, unloading, and transporting your power sports vehicles. So with that being said, let's take a closer look at our product options that we're installing today and get this installation started. <laughs> So we're gonna do a quick recap on the product options that we're gonna install on this trailer today. For the glide options, we're gonna be doing Caliber's Grip Glides. For the traction option, we're doing Caliber's Trax Grabber. We have an additional accessory that's gonna go up front. That's gonna be our Flex Glide Low. And we're also installing a handy trailer handle on this thing today. So let's take a closer look at the first product option and get the installation started. All right, so we're gonna continue our trailer series by looking at some cost-effective options and installations for your snowmobile trailers. Like we said at the beginning of the video, our glide installation for today is gonna to be Caliber's Grip Glides. Similar to the Low Pro Grip Glide, which offers traction as well as glide for your snowmobile skis, walking, ATVs, or side-by-sides, this is a segmented installation and it's recommended it's spaced out about eight to 10 inches. Now that we've covered some recommended installation options, we're gonna talk about some features and benefits and the specifications of the specific product. The Grip Glide is three inches by eight and a half inches and also comes in two different styles or two different types. Today we're gonna to be installing our deck mount option, but we also offer a ramp grip glide, which covers a one by one cross rail and is made specific for loading and unloading ramps. With those three options, we offer a 22 piece kit and a 32 piece kit for the deck mount options and we offer a 16 piece kit for the ramp grip glides. Now that we've covered both the features and benefits as well as the product specs, let's get this stuff out of the box and get the installation started. All right, so we have everything out of the box for one of these kits. As always, we have our stainless steel hardware here for installation and we have 16 individual grip glide pieces. We have three kits for this installation today. Like we said, this product is recommended for spacing at about eight to 10 inches. For this installation, because of the dimensions of the trailer, we're gonna space them at about nine inches on center. So with that being said, we're gonna get some of these things rough laid out and then we're gonna start screwing things into the trailer. All right, so a couple of quick tips before we get this installation started. Like we said, we have these things spaced out at about nine inches apart. Sometimes it does help to make like a little jig or a standoff to make sure that you keep that spacing consistent. Um, one other thing about the grip glides as well is that they are a directional product. So if you take a look at some of the photos or you take a closer look on the video, you will see that there is a rounded edge and that is the front side. So that's gonna aid in transition for the snowmobile skis. And then on the back side here, that's gonna be for tire engagement if you're loading and unloading ATVs or side-by-sides. Now that we have everything laid out for this first run, we're gonna get these things secured down to the deck of the trailer and then we're gonna move on to the other three. All right, so we have our two outer runs of glides installed on the trailer and we wanna give you a quick tip. Make sure before you get the center glides installed that you double check your ski stance and make sure that you have proper alignment on both the outside and the inside glides. We're gonna get that measured up and get the center lines installed, ready to go. So we just finished up the grip glide portion of this installation and we're gonna move on to traction. So we're gonna get rolling on the track grabber, but you're gonna to have to check that out on the next episode because that's it for today. For more information on the grip glides and all other Caliber products, make sure you visit our website at www.caliberproductsinc.com. And remember, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up. If you have any questions or wanna see something in a future video, drop it in the comments section below. If you wanna see more content from us, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you wanna see it right away, make sure you hit that notification bell. Always remember, stay safe and get your ride on.